Yeah, I use guys for sex because I want to get pregnant. And if I don't get pregnant, I'm going to leave them anyway. What do you think I about that? I use guys for money, jewelry, cars, whatever I can. And I get more than one, Saka. I use guys to buy me, my daughter clothes, everybody clothes. And I like what I do, and I am very proud of it. You go, you, girl. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, you go. Yeah, it is kind of nasty, isn't it? My goodness, we're not making this up. Uh, today you're going to meet people who say, I use. That's the word. I use. I use people for sex, for favors, for money, even to get pregnant. And uh, what do they do when they're through with someone? Consciously, it isn't subconscious. Consciously, I dump them. And they're very proud of their behavior. Now, the problem is that they live in a society and they've got friends who are family, who are furious. And they want the using friends to change their ways. How young? 17-year-old Mariana. She actually has a system uh, to how she uses the guys. Waiting backstage is Tony. He's one of the guys that Mariana says she uses all the time. Why in heaven's name would somebody put up with that? Mariana, before he comes out, tell me what you do. I use them for jewelry. You buy, you get jewelry, yeah. Yep, money. Money? But yeah. Right here. Yeah. All right. And... No, let her talk, let her talk. And, um, for rides to my boyfriend's house, they drive me there, they pick me up. Wait, I don't wait, 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 them. wait, I'm kind of confused. You have a boyfriend. Yeah. And then you have other guys? Yep. What are the other guys? <laughs> I don't have sex with the other guys. Um, yeah. Wait. <laughs> Maybe you guys do, but I What don't. are the other guys and, um, called? They're called guppies. Guppies? <laughs> you use the guppies to drive you to the boyfriend's house? Do the guppies come and pick you up? I beep them all, whoever calls back first takes me. Whoever comes back first. Okay, yeah. why would a guy put up with this kind of behavior? Somebody else is... I don't know. You don't know? Might be interesting fools, to ask. Know. How uh, do you feel deep down when uh, you treat somebody like that? Do you, don't you feel badly? No, it's their fault. What's going through your head? What? No, truth, what's going through your head? <laughs> Nothing. Come on. Um. <laughs> Why, no, is, if, if, why is it well, all right? No, if any of these girls here had a chance to have a boy to buy you anything you want, take you anywhere you want, yeah. all right, then a man, a boy, whatever you want to call him, yes. obviously he needs to grow up if he does it right, so I guess he's a boy. But anyways, if they all had a chance, they would do it. Oh, no. uh, don't act all innocent. What Respect you... yourself. Excuse me, I do not sleep with them. Yeah. Are you deaf? Yeah. What? You don't, Mariana? Whatever. Ask him when he comes out. Mariana, you don't sleep with the guppies. No, I don't. How many guppies are there in the uh, water tank? Like four or five. Four or five guppies, plus the boyfriend. How does the boyfriend feel? I don't know. You don't know. We'll ask him. He's All mad. right. Uh, does he the knows boy about it. It's his does friend. the boyfriend worried that so, you? So he knew, knows him. It's not his friend. Is the boyfriend worried you'll treat him that way? Yeah. Okay. Uh, the gut. One. We have a guppy backstage. <laughs> yes. Come on out, guppy. Come on. <laughs> Guppy has a name. His name is Tony. Tony, uh, why would you put up with this? You know she has a boyfriend. I know. Yeah. And uh, why would you be a guppy? Why would you want to do this? I just fell into that trap. I don't how did, understand. How did it happen? No, I, I did it, you know. <laughs> no, but how did it happen? How did I get guppy? Yeah. By buying her what I bought her, by giving her rides, cruising around, take her wherever she wants to go, you know? But what do you think is happening? Do you think I that... guess whatever she calls a guppy is what she thinks I am. Okay. Do, do you care about her? Huh? Do you care about her? Not too much anymore. 
not too much. <laughs> When I have four more. I don't care. You don't need them. You have four more. When you were a guppy, were you thinking that maybe she would someday be interested in you? Yeah, I was. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. I would think that you would have to have that kind of a reason, yeah. right? He loves uh, me. Come on, now. <laughs> Do you love her? Not yeah, anymore. Not anymore. She seems to oh, think so because of what I've done. me in one second. Not in one second. It took time. No. Does he love you? Yeah. And that's why, do all the guys love you? I don't know. Okay. Uh, let's meet Mariana's current boyfriend, who I guess is the rival for the guppies' uh, <laughs> affections. Uh, Tommy, your, your girlfriend Mariana is telling us with pride that she uses guys. She's saying she has no regard for their feelings. Oh my God. Do you know she does that? Yeah. How does it make you feel? Yeah, I don't like it too much. You don't like it. Do you think maybe she'll make you a guppy one day? No. <laughs> it will not make you a guppy. She don't ask me for anything. She doesn't ask you. Why don't you ask him for anything, but you ask all the other four or five guys for something? Because I don't need to ask him for anything. You don't need to. Because the other guys are giving you things. Yeah. What, what is it about her? What kind of person him? is Mariana that she does this? And she not only does it, she comes on television and tells people <laughs> she does it. I think that's, that's an amazing thing. What is with her? I don't know. Oh, it, it's a big thing in my city. They, a lot of girls do it. You do? <laughs> Tell me about the girls. This is a current thing that girls do? Yeah. They get, like, suckers to buy them things. <laughs> that you feel like they're suckers? Okay, I want you to meet. Thank you. I still don't understand it, but if it's a big thing in. I, I want you to meet 17 year old Tina. Tina, you come from. Too? No, I come from Ohio. Ohio. And this is her mother, Barbara. Do, uh, do girls act like this in Ohio where you come from, Tina? Yeah. They do, okay. So we've got a movement going here. <laughs> Tina admits that she too uses guys. But Tina has a very specific purpose in mind. Tina uses guys for sex because she wants to get pregnant. Okay? Boo <laughs> yourself, you know what I'm true. saying? It Boo is yourself. true, Mom? Yes, it is. Now tell me about it. Tina, first you. First go. I want a baby because that person's gonna love me forever. Oh, and that baby's never gonna be. <laughs> Now, okay, you're 17 years old. Yep. Do you use guys? Yeah, I use guys for the car, money, jewelry. Where do you think I get all this from? Okay. She works. She that's all my goal. She works a guy so bad. What happened? She this guy invited her to the prom, and he promised to buy her a prom dress. And he didn't get it though, you know. He so didn't he's get gone. it. Wait. Gone so he came over to pick her up on Wednesday. What he was supposed to do for her to, to help him, because uh, he got the limo and helped pick out the um, dress. Yeah, she wasn't there. I had to ex say hey, and then she was going with some other guy that put his hand through a brick wall because he's crazy about her. She used him. I wrote her a three-page letter. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, I'm better looking than you, right? A three-page letter. I wrote her. And she now, wants to get pregnant. Wait a minute. We got a problem here. <laughs> Uh, she uses them, and I get in the middle of it. How do you feel as a mother? I don't know what to do. You don't know what to do? No, they cry. They call me and cry on the phone. You know, it seems to me that the woman's movement took a left turn somewhere and went the wrong way. Uh, the idea of being independent and being strong does not mean using people. The, it doesn't mean acting like what were the bad things with men. Waiting backstage is an ex-boyfriend? Yeah. So why is he ex? Because I didn't get everything I wanted, you know? Why? I didn't get everything I wanted. Because, yeah, I guess if you want to say he was smart, he's, he left. She right? got rings from the guys. She got rings from I'm him? I'm still his friend, though. I'm always going to be there rings. as a friend for rings. him, though. Show me your rings. Okay. Friends. Let's uh, bring no, on out the nice uh, ex-boyfriend. Come on out, Ephraim. I got respect for my friends, though. Come yeah. on out, Ephraim. I got respect for my friends.
from? Are you from Ohio also? Yes. Tina has told us that the girls in her town do this, the boys, the girls in do this. You were listening to what she had to say. How does that make you feel? It makes me feel low. Off? Yeah. Why did you put up with it? Why? Because I liked her, you know, I still do. But uh, How do you feel now? How do I feel now? Not too good. Not too, Not good. too nope. swift. Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, first of all, for him, it's good that you woke up and keep waking up because she ain't all that. Oh. <laughs> second of all, second of all. We can't have all. this, all right? How, oh, how, are, you gonna pay, how are you going to pay for this child? How am I going to pay for this child? Yeah, you're going to use more guys? Well, no, I'm going to get a job. I'm going to get a job and do that well, on myself. Sure I don't need to depend on no guy. All right, everybody calm down. Mother, if she gets, she's 17, she doesn't have an education, she doesn't have a husband, she I wants to get it. pregnant. To she probably thinks you're going to take care of the child. No, she's going to be 18 pretty soon. And yes. I said, hello, are you out of the house? <laughs> Do you believe that mother will kick you out? No, not at all. She's, she'll support me. She'll be stick by my side. I, 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 I think so. I know my mother. You, Tina. You're going to stick by me. I know you. What about Ephraim? What about Ephraim? He's my friend. He's always going to be my friend. You know, I don't want to hurt his Is feelings. Is Ephraim like secretly else. in love with you? I think he still likes me. OK. He Good still enough. wants to be with me. Yes, ma'am? <laughs> It's for the first girl. You said you want a baby. I think you have to grow up because you are not old enough and mature to have a baby. I am mature. You, no, you let me talk. Who's going to take Sit care down. of your baby? Sit no, down. why don't you shut up, all right? You shut up. You want me to shut up? Your mom's going to be there all she your life? I don't somewhere. think so. She, I want to go somewhere. She was pregnant. Your mother is not going to be there all your life. And those guys, they're not going to take care of you and your baby all your life. You I need to grow up. I didn't say I need a guy to take care of And the guy got engaged. She didn't want to marry the guy. She had a miscarriage, so. She was pregnant before at 16, and she didn't want to marry him. And he gave her an engagement ring, and she just said, howdy else, goodbye. OK. I, uh, but she had a miscarriage. I'm now. asking myself if we're discussing a trend here of young girls who think that this is the way you should behave, men, uh, why in heaven's name is something like this happening? Sir. Um, what you ladies are doing, or, or what you young girls are doing, um, it didn't work for the Mayflower, madam, and it won't work. It didn't work for Heidi Fleiss. It's not going to work for you either. Um, the bottom line is that um, you're talking about having a baby to um, love. You need to learn how to love yourself first. Yes, ma'am. Um, I'm Mariana's friend, and it's not only her who does it, because I got another, my best friend. When they get together, it's on. Both of them, they gas any dude for what, and they stupid because they go for it. It's give me a ride here, and they pull a fit if they don't get it. So the boy, the men are like putting up with it because they don't want to hit their mouths. That's basically what it is. <laughs> mouths, and it's like. But this is a trend. This is I'm something. I'm not like that because I think it's wrong. You know, everything oh, I got, I work please. for it. I work for it. I, you know, yeah. if I want to sell you that bite, it's don't you know, it's my money. Back. I feel don't I get a paycheck. <laughs> not somebody else's. I don't gotta look at nobody else's face but my own for my money. <laughs> My Gappies for stuff for you, so. Yeah, it, exactly. Yeah, exactly. That's, right. that's, that's what, what I do. Exactly. So and I don't saying. gotta keep asking them for stuff. I, I can get my own. Yeah. I Cause ain't no man gonna be there for you for the rest of your life. Not you. I, that's you what it's about. You got I wonder you what's know, happening you with the men. Yeah, why there's no, no possible self-esteem. I don't. I mean, I don't quite get it. And why would women think that this is okay? All right, we're going to meet another woman who says ever since a guy used her and then dumped her, she vowed she's going to do the same thing. Again, following the worst traits that a man would have. Uh, a former boyfriend who is tired of being her doormat is also here with her fed-up friend. Now, the friend and the ex-boyfriend really want to change her ways. Can they? We'll see.
exciting thing to me about being able to do this show is that uh, I learned what's going on. We already know that an awful lot of young girls want to get pregnant. Uh, somebody to love them. We also know that young girls are joining gangs. Well, now we know about guppies and barracudas. <laughs> and uh, the idea behind this is it's chic right now for your young girl to use someone just to get something that you need with no regard for the other person's feelings. And that's what's going on with our guest today. Now, the boyfriend, who I don't understand for beans, you'll forgive me, that's one of your close friends? The guppy is one of your yeah. close? Yeah. So, why don't you talk to your friend and tell the guppy... I didn't know about it. I just found out. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to real life. I, I thought he was with her before, before I was with her. But you don't know he's still hanging around, swimming around the tank? No, he's not anymore. <laughs> okay. All right. I'm trying to make sense. Please meet, meet Christina. Now, Christina probably feels a bit the way I do, do you, Christina? Christina is here because she's fed up with how her close friend, Susan, treats men. Susan's waiting backstage along with an ex-guppy named Angel. First, Christina, tell me what Susan does that, that worries you as her friend. What's she doing that's so bad? Susan uses men for money, for clothes, to take her places, to take her to eat, to do anything. Susan is mean. I mean, if you're there more than 24 hours, you're paying rent. I mean, she doesn't, she's, she's just, she's, she uses and dumps them. She doesn't want to have nothing to do with a man. She doesn't want to be in love. She doesn't want to fall in love. Nothing to do with love. No commitment, no love, no nothing. Wow. And does that bother you? Yes, it does. What do you think is going to happen to her? Ten years from now, she's going to be all by herself. Nobody's going to want her. She's going to be alone, unhappy. She has a daughter and she's not, you know, she's going to be all by herself. She has a daughter? Yes. And she still does this? Yes. You know, <laughs> some would say that even if you think that what Susan does is wrong, she's not hurting anybody. I think she is. She's hurting other people. She's yes, hurting I my think... friend, number one, because he's really? my close friend. And she shouldn't be doing that to him because he's, you know, he just, all he did was care about her. All he wanted to do was care about her. I think we, we should hear from Susan. Susan, yeah. come on out. <laughs> Hi. Hi. You've heard what Christina's been saying. Is it true? Yeah, it's you true. You use men, you throw them aside. Yeah. I All like right. it. There's nothing Since wrong with where what are doing. you from? What I'm area? from Arizona. Arizona. <laughs> okay. All, all we're trying to find out is why. Why? Why do you do it? Because women, men have been using women since the beginning of time. It's for us, time for us to do it back. Yeah. I, I lie. How do I lie? You have I, never used a woman in your life. You're going to sit wait, there and wait, tell me that. Wait, but oh. why do you do it? Why do you do it? Uh, why? Because they're dumb. Men, men, I'm not saying all men are dumb, but most men are dumb. They just will do things for you. You give them some sad little story, they buy you things. But Susan, what about When you were in love with <laughs> Weren't you in love with him? And yeah. when he, after what he did to you, you just left him? Yeah, and now and I'm the no, bitch I but am now. there's no reason. Just because one guy did it to you doesn't mean every guy after that's going to do it to you. That's okay, though. I am young. I am young. I have plenty of time. No, no, no. Yeah. no but you're not. You're 24. What, what about? I'm Arizona is a very small place. I there's very have to few live men there. there. I there's very have few to men live there. there. When I'm done with Arizona, I'll go to another state. <laughs> You're going to use up all the guys in Arizona? <laughs> apparently so. She, apparently she did. She, she can. She's used up sex. Ohio and she's used up Massachusetts. She has very Where little. are you headed? Nowhere. Colorado. Nowhere. Colorado. <laughs> she's headed a long Look out, Colorado. <laughs> One of the ex-boyfriends, Angel or Angel, has been waiting backstage. I think it's time we heard from someone who's been at the receiving end of the treatment. Angel, come on out. Angel, you dated Susan for six months. Mm -hmm. uh, did she use you? Yeah. What did she use you for? Money. Money? Babysitting. Babysitting? <laughs> <laughs> she, 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 would, she would go out with me, we would go to the clubs, and he would sit home and babysit for her. Oh my goodness. There ain't nothing wrong with that. It's the name. He would go 
buy her clothes to go out. Wait, wait, wait. Did you you would buy her clothes to go out? And give her money. I gave her money to go out. I I did everything. I fixed her car. He cared about her so much, and she just did not care. Why did you do this? Because I care about her. I love her. Do you still love her? Yeah. <laughs> Why are you laughing for it? Ain't funny. Can I help I'm you sorry. find somebody else? Yeah. Please help. do. You don't want somebody that's going to care about him. Yeah. Someone that's going to treat me good. Him. I want him and not just it. use him. And not just use him. Did you know while you were being used that you were being used? At the beginning, no. And then what happened? She, I just realized, you know, after a while, she just started making excuses, you know, and just. Susan, don't you feel embarrassed by any of this? No, I would. Why should I be embarrassed? I, I would. would. I Why would. aren't you embarrassed? I'm not embarrassed. I'm not embarrassed. You're I not embarrassed. Real embarrassed. Need no. to be used. I mean, use men because it's a commitment. 50-50. 50-50. All right, right, now wait a minute. He's not a little boy. He's don't a you? Uh, don't How do you know? Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. 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 Hold has to take care of it. I didn't say he had to. I said there's nothing wrong with a man babysitting a baby. He baby. He He's knew I didn't like him no more. I went out. I'm like I'm going out to you find to somebody lie. new. So. I, yes, ma'am. I just like to say to all the women it who is use, your who you use, you all look used. Up. You will be used. You continue to to use men, and you will meet your match, honey. Okay. Keep on. What you're saying is there's a kind of hard attitude about the women. Is that what you're thinking? Weathered is more the word. Weathered. Weathered. Oh, Weathered. Oh, <laughs> I have a question now. Good looking couples up there, by the way. Very good looking couples. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, Tony. Oh, check your hair out. Shamrock on the back of your head. Happy St. Patrick's oh, Day. Oh, shut Day, now, you're the guppy, but the boyfriend's sitting over there. But you're the guppy. What's the so, point? So, uh, that means you're the boyfriend. Oh, sit down. You look like uh, a guppy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you look like somebody on, I would, I would on, suck at. So sit down. You, boy, mm -hmm. your big hair, dude. You, got, you gave her all that gold on your hand? You got nothing for it but a shamrock on the back of your head? Oh, shut up. You're going to have a big <laughs> Sit down. Sit yes. down. Oh, shut now, up. You know what? He's, no it's very interesting. Mouth. It's very, to the guys oh, on the up. panel, it's very interesting, but it's very what? hard for some people to understand why you're doing this. What? All right, when we come back, let's turn the tables. Let's take a look at what this man, man, yeah. says. Yeah, how you doing, Sally? I use women, I take them out, I treat them a little bit good in the beginning, and then afterwards, once they get what they wanted from me, the cards turn, they give me their car, they pay my rent, my phone bill. Anything I ask them to do, they do. Yeah, That's right. the way it goes. That that. In my day, that was called a gigolo. Meet one when we return. What we have been told is a trend across the country. Young women who admit and are kind of proud of using men to get things they want. And then uh, what do they do? Well, they dump the guys when they've outlived their usefulness. Yeah. You were trying to say to me. Yeah, first of all, this little girl here, she has no manners. She's 17. And no respect. 
She needs to go to like charm school and get some. And another thing, you, you, you disrespect your mother. That's you sit right, up I there, to to excuse me, excuse me. You, you like disrespect your mother. You sit up there with your legs open. You sit up there with your legs open. And another thing, another thing. Uh -oh. This lady is talking. No, no, yeah, that's right. Take a lick and get out. Excuse me, I am your elder. I'm 24. Exactly. Thank you very much. But any this little gold that you have on. In New York, we go to Jamaica Avenue and get that gold. That's called fool's gold, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's called fool's gold. Oh, you know what I'm saying? You know, the problem Along with we'll that have everybody necklace on in the your world, neck, too, right? We'll have everybody in the world on Jamaica Avenue. Please meet... Oh, I can admit mine's real. Gennaro or Hinero? Gennaro. Gennaro. Gennaro looks like he's been building some bodies. He says that women like it when he uses yeah, that's right. them and then dumps them. It's a lot better, pal. Trust me. Gennaro. You look like Rosie Greer. That's all right. Gennaro, how do you, talk to me. How do you make a statement like that? What kind of woman wants to be treated badly? Well, you, you come off with a little class at first and you fool them. So they think you're, like, not, like, you're not like every other guy. <laughs> Whatever. You're not like every other guy. So then they get attracted to that, and then once you got them fooled the way you want them, then you turn the cards around. <laughs> everything, I, be, everything now becomes my way, the way I like it. And when I don't show them as much attention, that turns them on even more. So you have when you give it to them, when girl. you give it to them, they take advantage of it. I'm not about so to. So you that. have girl guppies around? Exactly. Well, anyways, how many at a time? Say right now about 12, 13. Oh, oh, easy. 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 Are you dressed like that when you're impressing somebody? Are you dressed like that? Show us one. Everybody get calm. Give us give us an example of how you use how you use somebody. I'm sorry, I didn't hear you. You have twelve or thirteen guppies, female guppies. How would you use somebody? Oh, go out a few times, spend a little money on them, take them out to a nice place to eat. No, I know what you're doing for them. Oh, what they do for me? Yeah. Oh. Well, if I need my phone bill paid and I don't feel like paying it, I can afford it, but I don't feel like paying it, they'll pay it for me. If I want my rent paid, if I need clothes, if I need clothes, if they want to put gas in my car, whatever the deal is, whatever they feel like doing at the time. But if, I usually don't even have to ask. They just do it on their own. Just do it on their own. Exactly. I'll wake up in the morning, it'll be egg on a roll with a coffee, nice, light, and tight. What's up? Oh, yeah. You jealous you can't get it? I, I just want to say, ladies, you are putting women back 100 yes. years. Okay? And for the lady in the stripes, never, ever leave your child with a stranger or a man. Stranger. You are, it doesn't matter, time. lady. You don't know you who You can't is. leave your kid, and then you're going to be one of the women that cry because they No, 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 no. I no, 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 Barbara, dear. Barbara, you say, oh, what can I do? Well, you put your finger in her ring, and you drag her, and you beat her a little ass. You need to <laughs> Be serious for a minute. Would you not like to find? Would you? Would you not like to find a nice woman? Would you not like to find a nice person? Yeah, in time. I'm not ready for it. But I got I got a girl in the audience right now that can verify. She lives next door to me. She knows exactly what goes on in my apartment. Where is she? She's right there, standing up. Oh, 
something? Be the I, I don't believe he's for real. No, believe me, it's for real, Sally. Believe Honestly, me. I would swear this guy was an actor. I would swear it. Sally, believe me, the way he talks to girls, it's unbelievable. He'll tell them, I want you for one thing, one thing only, and they don't care. They don't care. I mean, the girls have so low self-esteem of themselves. But these girls are beautiful. You would not believe the girls that he, he's with. I, they come in my house, and I'm like... Crispy, clean, and back oh on the scene. Oh, my God. I'm like, so what is wrong with these girls that they would put them... So he's for like real? Yeah. He's for real. I would not lie. I would not lie. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. The phone rings off the hook. I come home at 11 o'clock at night from school. These girls will keep calling, keep calling, keep calling. He hangs up on them. They just keep calling. They just keep calling. They come to the house. They knock on the door. They wake me up. I'm telling you, it's unbelievable. <laughs> you are amazing. Okay, sit down. Yes, ma'am. I just want to say, <laughs> first of all, some respect. Young lady, you haven't re met the right man yet. I'm okay? still young. I got lots you of time You want to have a baby? Have a baby, because you're going to run into the one man that's going to use and abuse you. And then that's that's the the then why don't you get a job? Then why don't you get a job? Get, a job. And get your own stuff instead of you using men. Wait, we don't, don't got to worry about that. You ain't got no position to get on one page, because, you know, because you know, the vengeance that you're trying to exact is going to come back on your door, OK? It's going to come back on your door, OK? Mr. Gennaro, I got eight daughters. And the only way one of them would go oh, out with Brooklyn. you, they'd have to bring you home on a leash and a chain. Oh, I sound like, like from Arizona. You know, to hear these users tell it, they get everything they want with no string to attach. So, how do friends get them to change? She's next. We'll find out next. We'll be right back. to get a little bit better for people to kind of elevate themselves. Meet Dr. Judy Koryansky. Oh, yeah. As I said, Judy, I, I want to know why someone would treat another person this way. Why, why does the person do it? I mean, why don't you want to Go home feeling good about yourself at the end of the day? I would think so. Well, I've got this little devil wand here because you would think that uh, these girls, Susan and Tina and Mariana, have a little devil in them, would you say? A little devil. More than a okay, little. But, but more Sally, than a little. More than a little. There is a reason they have the devil in them because they're dog and guys now because they've been dogged and now they're giving them a bit of their own medicine Whoa, right back and that's right what they're doing. Yeah. Yeah, I do Girl, what but I not do. every guy yeah. is the same way. That's the reason. I know that. Uh, you let him have it. You never hooked up with nobody like that. Believe me. That's Thank exactly God. why. Thank God. They call me 10 years later to hook up with me. Believe me. They do, uh, Sally, uh, because... He's not even in the water. You, you, you all, gotta let Judy talk. Go you ahead. You all know this. They've been hurt. So, Susan, you've been hurt? Mm -hmm. Is that why you turned around to now use guys? Mm -hmm. oh, because you've been hurt. Oh, okay. What I was Mar Mariana, have you been hurt? Yes. Oh. Oh, wow. Is that when it started? No. <laughs> and Tina, have you been hurt? I've been hurt and I've been raped. Yeah. Okay, she said she's been raped and also... You Wait a minute. Tina, that's very serious. What are you yes. talking about? She has. Tina, let me stop with the jokes. What are you talking about? Mm. Tina, talk to me. Tell her. It's okay. Tell her, Tina. It's okay. I didn't ask for it, though. <laughs> what happened, Tina? Mom, what happened? She was going with this guy. I'm not. I can't mention his name. Yeah. She got pregnant by him. Okay. She had a miscarriage, and they broke up. Okay. Well, she she goes in this neighborhood where she has another friend that another boyfriend that well, a friend let's say a boyfriend that she hangs around with. Well, she was drinking, which she really shouldn't have done. But I don't think she was really drunk or that. So she asked him if she can use the bathroom, 
And um, he said, sure. So she thought he was, she was going to go to his house and use the bathroom. Well, he took her over to the aunt's house, which wasn't too far away. And her friends were going to help her. And he said, no, no, no. He said, I'll help her in. And he got her in the bathroom and he raped her. When did this happen? Saturday. Friday. This Saturday. This Saturday? Mm -hmm. Did you call the police? No. Can I ask why you didn't call the police? Because they'll kill me. They were close. Wait a minute, wait a minute. They would kill us. He's what do you crazy. mean they'd kill He's you? Crazy. They're mm, Tell me. They're He's violent. They they're violent people. They're Spanish Spanish people. I don't know. No, care. it's not Spanish people. A wacko. When do you ever see me date a white guy? All the Puerto Ricans I've been with have always treated me He's good. He's wacko. He's a There's, wacko. You've got your good white people, your good Puerto Rican people, wacko? your good black I think, people. I think There's what, always. It's, it's not about color. Color means nothing. I think what we He's see crazy. from this is, just, and everybody recognizes this, is just how much Tina needs to be taken care of and how much help that she really needs because. I don't understand, they will retaliate Dr. Judy, I don't understand why they would not call the police. They I mean, will retaliate on us. They know where we live. This guy is really a vicious person. Right. He's got a whole Do family. You, are you telling me that there's a world in which you can go around and commit any crime? And well, if you he act thinks strong, he can, which he has done a Well, he has committed a crime, and he is not she being held she accountable. She doesn't want to prosecute him. She's afraid that we're going to be killed, my, my husband and me. Right. Well, you see, and that's one of the reasons, I mean, this is a very extreme case, and, and we'll do something to help her about this, but the point is that Tina's very extreme about it. Every woman who ends up being what we call a manizer now, because there used to be womanizers, and now there's manizers, and they do it to protect themselves, because she's been so hurt. And every one of these women, right, you will say this too, Mariana, you will not be hurt by a man again if you turn around and hurt them. Isn't that what you feel? Yeah. Dr. Judy. Is that what you feel? The Dr. Judy. That's how they're protecting themselves. Is that a smart protection? No. no. Is, is there any love here at all, for goodness sake? I mean, they are trading, being protected. This happened on Saturday. You were raped by a man, and you know the man, and you won't do she anything. Said, the girls told me she said no. They heard her saying no, no. And when you mean no, you mean no. They told me. She didn't tell me till the next day. I had. The How did girls, you find out? The Mom? girls were all staying over at my house Friday, and we were talking downstairs. We had a rap session. It was Saturday. Saturday morning, was it? No, Saturday night. They happened? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Well, this mother comes over to pick up her daughter, and she told me, My daughter stayed with your daughter at night because your daughter was raped. And I said, What? I said, I can't believe this. Why didn't you tell your mother? Because. My mother's not like my friend. I can't tell her things without her jumping down my throat, without her going back and telling my relatives about it. You mean your dad? My dad, relatives. When I have personal problems, I can't talk to her about them. I have to go to my friends or guy friends. But for look, how wonderful, look how wonderful your mom is being right now. Is she not being wonderful for you right now? I yeah. went up and I, I, she locked the door. I went up and I knocked on the door. I said, Tina, let me in. Let me talk to you. I don't want to talk to you. I said, well, Tina, I can't help you if you don't. So she opened the door and she told me what happened. You know, and she cried for a long time about it. I said, I want to take her to the hospital. You know, no, 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 no. I'm the press in charge. But I think since she's a minor, I can do it. Right. Go to the police. That's absolutely right. I don't, you, help me. What are you saying? You gotta go. This is your daughter. You're flesh and blood. You're gonna let some low life treat your daughter that way, no matter who he is. You have to. You must parent. go to the police. She's underage, and you're the parent. He's going to do it again to somebody else's daughter. Take a break. We'll be right back. I have a question for Susan. When somebody feels that it's all right to kind of pay society back or pay somebody back, will they ever change? 
Well, I think as long as these girls have all been hurt, and until they see in their mind that love and that they can trust a man, and they can pick somebody who will care for them and really love them, and they can be vulnerable, they're not going to change, but they don't want to change. Do you want to change? Not right now. Mariana, do you want to change? No. Let's talk to me about Tony and Angel. How should a man deal with a woman like this? Well, what we have in the men here are three men who are... We need to shut them all. Doormats, Luka. 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 right? Shut they up. are doormats. Ephraim, now, I meant to include you, do too, you, so do I apologize. You not, you, do you not acknowledge that you're being a doormat? I, yeah, I do. I mean, so then, this, uh, you know? Why do you allow that to happen, where you could be stepped on and that you don't no, get anything back? No, because I have back? a heart. Obviously, you don't. That's why you're alone now, probably, right? So you, okay, so now yeah. doormats, men who are doormats, <laughs> men who are doormats, like women who are doormats, have very low self-esteem. The, the wonderful part about them is they are giving, but to a fault, because they give to people who treat them like dirt. That's not really giving. That's you, being desperate. Are you listening, so Efron? Are you does, listening? We'll be right back. Way. Right? You are the power. You are my soul. You know, Tina and Barbara, I'm not afraid of anybody. Uh, I'm going to ask the police in the town to go and investigate. He can't blame you. He's got to come yes. after me. Yeah. Now. now, what about Gennaro? Well, it's a circle of using. Gennaro will keep using women until, is there a woman in the audience here who's willing to volunteer to be the woman who teaches him a lesson? And will end up using him, yes? A few? Not many women. hands up, because you know you'll right? lose. Yeah? Be because, I got it. I got it. Because what happens. I didn't see any hands go up, because you know you're going to lose. Go ahead. That will take the only, the only way they change. Like Susan, when will you change, Susan? <coughs> when I meet somebody I really care about. I don't care about anybody I use. When she meets somebody she cares about. And over here, over here with, with you, you have ended up, this is a man who's be, who is being a doormat, but he's dogged a lot of women. Right? Have you not? And you're getting a dose of your own Reverse medicine psychology. now. So what goes around, comes around. Yes, sir. You know, I kept saying, well, maybe it's a trend. Maybe there's something new happening out there with women acting like this. But Dr. Judy is right. What goes around comes around. It's a story as old as time. Come see us again.